guys, I just wanted to show a quick video on how I fill up my water tank. I have a 275 gallon water tank in my van and I always fill it up with deionized water. It helps with the drying process. You don't get any hard water stains, uh, so it's perfect. That's why I like to purchase my water, use soft water. Um, some people will use their garden hose and actually use a filtration system to, you know, to convert it so it filters it, but that's not ideal situation for myself right now, so I come and buy my water. I think it's uh, 11 cents a gallon, just so you know. So check it out. Just a, a detailing shop right over here. They've got a storefront, then they have the self-serve uh, water. fill it up too much I mean that's already pretty much more than I usually fill it up uh, completely full it's an extra 2400 pounds of just water so I'm gonna be very careful with that much weight Once I forgot to screw on the cap and the little water was slushing around, slushing out of it. So you can always remember. So that's how I get my water. Just come to this little uh, detailing shop about two miles from my house and fill up. I'm going to show you how I wash my my van, it needs a good washing. So, we're going to go right here. There's a drain right there too. So I'm going to show you guys how I wash my van. Very, uh, very easy wash. I use one of these brushes. The van is big, so you can imagine I'm not going to use wash mitts to do this entire van uh, as often as I have to do it. So. I've got so much water in my tank, I'm going to do a pre-rinse a pre first and then, uh, and then I'm going to use the foam on it and then scrub it and rinse it again. So let's see if I can get a good camera position here.
or so, got my van washed, got it spray waxed, uh, tires dressed, it's looking pretty good. I want to make my business my priority. Back in uh, 2018, November 2018, I, I weighed 225 pounds and I told myself, I told myself I'm going to get fit, I'm going to get in shape. So I started walking for two months, I, I walked about 15,000 to 25,000 steps every day and I didn't really see too much change in two months but I started going to the gym January 7th, 2019. And I went to the gym uh, for most of the year of 2019. And I, I was working out all the way till the gyms closed uh, just recently. And so I went from 225 down to 185, probably about 38% body fat to about, I'm guessing, 14%. And that was just one thing I, I had that was a priority in my life. I kept saying, I'm going to get in shape and you know being a detailer you have to be in shape and I was doing it just to feel good about myself and just feel healthier and be able to move around better detailing cars but then I realized I was focusing way too much on just getting in shape and not focusing enough on the business and and uh, I want to set some goals for the business now and not just my personal health and fitness Hey guys, thanks for watching my video. I appreciate it. Please leave some comments below. Let me know what you liked about it, what you didn't like about it. Hit that like button, even if you didn't like it. Hit it anyway. I just made this video to get a little bit uh, better with my editing skills. I'm not very good, so I just need some practice and and uh, I need some content ideas so I can get some more practice. You know, a video that should probably take less than an hour uh, probably takes me four days because I sit there and think way too hard about what I should do, what I shouldn't do. And If you haven't seen my other video of where I kind of walk, walk you through the van, uh, check it out. It's probably going to pop up right up here or over there or maybe nowhere because I don't know how to do YouTube. <laughs> anyway, thanks guys. Appreciate it. Josh. Yo, Josh, it's Damon Fryer from Daily Driven Exotics. How you doing? There he is. Hey guys. How are you? Good. How are you? Nice wrap. Yeah, bro, you got it done by PFS. <laughs>